Hey everyone, Dennis Kay here with Belize Islands Real Estate. Hope you are all doing well today. Uh, today's video is going to be basically a follow-up for myself, so I don't forget anything, but also for several clients that I had on Zoom calls today. It's been a long day, and I just want to make sure I get all my clients the information that they're looking for. So this might not apply to all of you, but I'm sure if you watch, you're going to uh, glean one or two tips or tricks that you can use on your next trip down to Belize. So first of all, Amira from Michigan, talking to you today. I saw the beautiful snow in the background and uh, certainly isn't any of that in Belize. So I know you're looking forward to your trip down the end of February and uh, I'm going to put you in touch with Israel. who will be making plans to uh, meet you at your Airbnb, pick you up and uh, show you different property options. So that'll be on February 27th at 9.30 a.m. So very nice talking to you and I'm looking forward to uh, seeing how we can work together on your project in Belize. Uh, my next Zoom call was with John. Uh, John, it looks like you're going to be visiting around the April and May time frame. So what I'll do is I'll show you several places that I'm recommending that you check out to stay. And uh, also, uh, there are some condos, some two and three bedroom condos uh, that you might take a look at as well that I'm going to give you some information on, as well as uh, some beachfront lots and off beach properties as well. So for example, John, um, we're not sure if this is still gonna be available, probably not, but if you can find something down south, for example, here is a beautiful beachfront property. It already has a seawall in place. It's been filled, it's ready to build on. Uh, it's direct oceanfront. And this is uh, 225,000. So the lot is 50 by 111, south of town about four and a half, five miles. And uh, something like this, I think, might work really good for you. You could buy this property, uh, put up a nice Airbnb on it, maybe like a four-bedroom home or maybe a three-bedroom home with a couple of casitas. I think that would work uh, really, really well for you. Also, I'm looking for something for you along the West Coast. Uh, Laguna Estates might have something coming up. And uh, a little bit farther north, I think you already saw the properties up by Margaritaville. Um, those are probably going to sell by the time you come down in April, but... Uh, we have some other things up there you might want to take a look at as well. So looking forward to working with you too, John, and thanks a lot for the great Zoom call today. Uh, next up was uh, Will. Uh, so Will, you and your wife, that was a great call with you guys, by the way, in uh, Texas. And uh, you guys have been to Belize, but only on a cruise ship. So you were able to see Belize City, but not the beautiful island. So I'm really excited for you guys to come down and check out uh, Ambergris Key. Um, it's, it's a really cool place. So let me just show you a couple of things because I had recommended some places for you to stay. Um, let me kind of go through those now. So first one was Victoria House. Yeah, it looks like they're uh, offering a special package deal. So 25% off snorkeling dinners and more. So that's a pretty good deal. Victoria House is located uh, two miles south of Ambergris Key. Let me see if this video plays. <laughs> Yeah, pretty good. So Victoria House is a great place to stay. Also, they have two fantastic restaurants there, a great spa. You can get a massage out on the beach, and it's absolutely stunning. So check that place out. Another good place to check out for you guys is Grand Carib. This is located about a mile north of San Pedro town. Uh, it's uh, completely built out, open. I think it's got three pools, hot tub, uh, several restaurants on site. Just a beautiful, a beautiful resort. I think you guys would like that. The other one I talked about was the Phoenix. Uh, the Phoenix is located just a few blocks north of San Pedro Town. So this is downtown San Pedro. Uh, puts you in a great location. Now, San Pedro Town can be busy with a lot of golf tra car traffic and trucks going back and forth. But when you're in this property, it feels absolutely amazing. And uh, like I told you on our Zoom call, the interiors of those condos are just absolutely spectacular. Another option for you guys was Las Terrazas. This is about uh, three miles north of San Pedro Town. Got a great beach, fantastic restaurant, nice pool, uh, really modern and feel, beautiful palm trees as you see. This is a great place for you guys to check out too. And uh, the reason why I suggest these places is because some of the condos that you are looking at possibly uh, purchasing are all in this general area as well. So for example, Seascape Villas. Uh, one of these villas is for sale, and uh, we can see if we can get you in to take a look at that when you come down um, later on in, in February. 
Uh, also, you guys are looking at a deal at Cocoa Beach. Uh, so if you stayed at Cocoa Beach, that would be good because you guys not only can check out uh, the unit there, whatever's for sale, but uh, you guys would also be able to enjoy the pool. And um, for your son, this has a, a great water slide here in this back pool. So he would absolutely love it. Uh, the other place is at uh, Ocean, there you go, condo number five at Ocean's 23. So I believe this one is still for sale. This is a great two bedroom, two bath, uh, about 1800 square feet. And it's got a really cool feel to it. Right on the ocean, of course, beautiful Caribbean views, absolutely stunning. And that's a great price too, 365 for a true oceanfront condo uh, that, that really can't be beat. And also you were looking at uh, Diamante. The Diamante is located just uh, to the south of the Blue Water Grill, one of my favorite restaurants. And so if you want to see something there, we can also arrange that. Now, as far as, I had, I had a couple more things picked out for you. Oh, yeah. So who was it? It was uh, Ben and Kristen. Let's not forget about you guys. So Ben and Kristen, I'm excited for you guys to stay at both in both parts of, of Ambergris Key. So you're staying at the uh, Mahogany Bay Village Project, the Hilton Curio Collection. That is absolutely beautiful. You'll love it there. And while there, absolutely don't miss eating at Giotto's Sushi Bar and Japanese Restaurant. It is absolutely fantastic. Some of the best sushi on the island. And uh, when you go there, get the Mitchell Roll uh, in honor of Will Mitchell. Uh, he created his own uh, sushi roll along with um, the chef and uh, is very popular. So get that. And uh, also uh, check out the Blue Water Grill. This is my favorite restaurant uh, for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Fantastic menu. And then finally for a treat, if you guys want to, you know, bring out the white crisp linens and go all fancy in your flip-flops, head up to Mambo's at Mata Chica. Uh, this is their outside dining area, but their inside is under a huge Palapa roof. And it is just really, really cool in there. Uh, so you would dig it. This, this picture doesn't do it justice. This is like a, the morning breakfast area, but inside um, is, is just beautiful. So you guys check that out, Ben and Kristen. And uh, for all of you, looking at properties. I know most of you are looking at properties in and around Secret Beach or maybe on the northeast side. Um, between now and then, uh, we need to kind of nail down what it is you're going to be looking for, your price point, your areas. And the reason for that being is right now, our inventory is extremely limited. And whatever might come up, for example, Monday, I'm looking at listing two uh, uh, second row properties at Secret Beach side-by-side -side properties. One is a cash deal. The other comes with financing. As soon as I put those out on my YouTube channel, those will probably sell within 24 to 48 hours. And so what I'd like to do with, with all of you who is, I was on Zoom calls with today, John and Will and Amira and Ben and Kristen, is that between now and the time you come down, keep me posted. If you see things on any of my websites, my videos, or, or, or other people's websites. For instance, if you're going to Remax or Sunrise or uh, Cowell Bank or whatever it is, if you see properties that interest you, let me know. As the time gets closer, we'll verify if they're even still available. And then we'll, um, we'll take a look at uh, showing you those properties. Uh, my guy Israel on the island, if he's available, he can show you. If not, I work with other team members that can show you properties. Uh, and especially if you want to get inside some of these condos. For example, uh, if the condo is being rented, then it can be a challenge to get in there because obviously you don't want to interrupt the vacationers. So especially with condo showings and home showings, uh, it takes a little bit of scheduling. But for vacant land, those can be easily seen in, uh, in a matter of just a couple hours. So we will go from there. I had more Zoom calls, but I think I'm going to leave this video as is for now because it gives, it gives a nice update. <coughs> Again, um, if you weren't on a Zoom call with me today, I still hope that this information was valuable because, hey, you're probably planning your trip down to Belize soon. And maybe some of these recommendations I gave on where to stay, what to see, what to do might be helpful for everyone. So thanks a lot for tuning in. If you would, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Uh, the more people that see my videos, the, uh, the more fun stuff and I have and the uh, better time we get to work with uh, clients like yourself to help you live the dream down in Belize. So appreciate that. And if you want to get me on a Zoom call, uh, then just go ahead and click the other link below and buy me a coffee. And uh, Steph and I certainly appreciate your support in uh, supporting our caffeine habits.
All right. Thanks a lot. Have a great Friday, a good weekend, guys. And we'll talk to you soon.